Volumill is a high-performance toolpath plug-in engine that you can use for high-speed milling. If you've purchased the Volumill add-in for Camworks, you'll be excited to know that it's fully integrated in roughing operations for 2.5 and 3-axis milling. Volumill gives you the ability to create incredibly efficient toolpaths and intelligent slot and slide milling options automatically. It can help you quickly machine small pockets while automatically adjusting and controlling the feed rate. Here I have a part I'd like to mill. The first thing I'll do is switch over to the feature tree and extract the machinable feature for this part. Next, I'll quickly generate an operation plan for this part. To use volume mill, I'll simply select it from the pattern dropdown on the roughing tab of the operation parameters. Volume Mill is an optional module within Camworks that can be used in place of traditional roughing methods to reduce cycle times, extend tool life, and reduce stress on machine tools. It's a toolpath strategy that enables much faster and deeper cuts than traditional toolpath strategies while avoiding sharp directional changes to control material removal rates and to significantly extend tool life. Volume mill can be used on any material type but works especially well on harder materials where the penalties for employing poor machining dynamics are more severe, both in machining time and cutting tool life. What volume mill does is it will produce no sharp corners, reduce stress between cuts, it has constant removal rates, and it establishes and maintains ideal machining conditions. Let me go ahead and simulate the tool path so you can see what I mean. Notice how the tool works on each feature, machining it using a variety of different patterns, toolpaths, and speeds. Volumill sets all this up automatically, giving you efficient cuts and faster machining times. I'll click this button here to bring up the Volumill settings. You have two entry methods for cutting into the part. You can use either the ramp or spiral entry methods. You can adjust the angle as well as the entry length and floor clearance. These settings basically tell Volume Mill when to stop and start the cut. Below, you can also use the spin box to set the smoothing radius. You can almost always leave all of these settings at the default values and they'll work really well, but I wanted to show you that you have the option to adjust these if you like. I'll accept these settings and show a preview of the operation. Let me simulate the toolpath. Notice how Volume Mill takes advantage of almost the full depth of the flute length as it machines the feature. Also notice how the tool lifts and feeds over during the rapids since Volume Mill knows what material has been removed. Let me run Volume Mill again on this pocket feature here. I'll activate Volume Mill. And again, simulate the toolpath for the rough mill operation. Notice the tool spiraling in and removing the material at the pocket. I highly recommend purchasing this add in to Camworks, and if you have, I recommend using it as often as possible. Volume Mill can really cut down your cycle time and your costs to machine each part. It's extremely efficient, and if you have it, use it as often as you can.